Hey Virgo, this is Nikki. Happy Wednesday. Hump day, hump day, hump day. I'm telling y'all, yesterday, I don't know what was going on with me. I was so tired yesterday. When I got home off work, I laid down in the bed and I went to sleep and I didn't wake up till this morning until it was time to go to work again. Okay. I needed that sleep. I was out of it. I was literally exhausted. Sometimes you all, we know we just got to shut it down. Okay. So we're going to see what messages the spirit has for you today. You all may hear the water running. My daughter is in her taking a shower and it's storming. So I want to try to get this reading done. Plus I have a, a, um, phone reading tonight. Make sure I'm clear for all of that. See, just in case the lights go out with this storm. What messages do we have here for the earthly Virgos? What do you need to know today? Whenever you see this message, uh, we got the eight of pentacles. What does Virgo need to know today? Virgo, what do you need to know? Uh, you, your hard, hard work and dedicated efforts, you know, um, it's like you could be lead, um, laying the groundwork for success in whatever it is that you're doing in your life. Ooh, we got the Ace of Swords. All right. So financial rewards for your hard work. Okay. Ooh, the Empress. Some of you all may be becoming a boss, being the person in charge here. Okay. Uh, this is saying that you've done such a such a such hard work in your life that you are being rewarded just for being who you are, or just because of the growth potential that you have in your life. What are rewards are coming your way? What exactly is it that you need to know today, Virgo? Okay. <clears throat> what do you need to know right now? We have stay. Stay the course. You know, don't give up. You know, right when you think you're not doing enough or or you feel like, hell, you know, no matter how much I do, you know, I'm never going to grow. I'm never going to thrive. Yes, you are. Keep on moving. Don't give up. Okay. Enjoy this transition. Enjoy what it is that's coming your way. Just enjoy what it is you, you're doing. It may not be. You may feel like you're stuck or stagnant, maybe a little bored, but you keep on doing what it is you're doing. Believe in yourself. Believe that spirit has something planned for you. I hear water running in here. My daughter's showering and it's thundering outside. So I hope you all can hear this message. Sorry for the interferences. Virgo, what do you need to know today? And we have a level. So you're being, um, your levels are about to, to increase. Um, being able to go to, a, to the next level, stay the course, don't give up at the last moment. And maybe somebody is something about your levels, maybe high blood pressure, sugar levels are up. Uh, if you're diabetic or maybe pre-diabetic level, sugar levels are up. Potassium levels for somebody is up. Checking your, your levels, maybe even having a, a fasting blood sugar test done or something like that. See, you see right now you got to stay until it's time to leave. You'll know when it's time to leave the situation, but right now you have to stay. You're being prepared to move forward. You're being, I can't even talk. You're being prepared for the next level, Virgo. But hey, that's your choice, what you're wanting to do. You either stay or go, but that's purely your choice. And some of you may just leave by choice because you, you feel that you've stayed the course too long and it's just not working. And possibly this is your chance right now. Like, OK, I knew that I was ready to leave. I know that nothing was happening. Why don't I just go ahead and make that move now? OK, some of you all know that it's your time to move. And some of you all are being positioned to just stay at, stay right now. See, somebody's time is up. It's, this is a good idea for you to move. So it's time for you to level up. OK. And you know who you are. I'm going to clarify the stay card here for Virgo. What you need to know today, stay. So we got love. Somebody wants you to stay in their corner, okay? Stay in their corner when it comes to love. Clarify the spirit card for Virgo. We have the ace of wands. You know what? Blessings are coming. Spirit is blessing you and your life with certain opportunities, a new beginning, um, being fertile in your life. Some of you are fertile, getting pregnant. Uh, fucking <laughs> so, okay uh, dipping and dabbing and, and not wearing protection riding up you know you know what i'm saying ladies you know riding cowboy okay getting pregnant that's 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 your blessing you know whether you're prepared for pregnancy or not that's a blessing for you so you're growing wow i don't know i you know what i don't know what's 
you're drinking or, or eating, but I just really do think that there's something beautiful coming your way here. Open up. There's emotional fulfillment and joy coming into your life because we did have the enjoy court card earlier here. You know, uh, this is saying so many good things are happening to you. We have you moving on, you evolving, you starting again in your life at a different stage. You know, this is saying I'm ready to to move forward. I'm ready to prove my value and my worth, not only to me, to somebody else, but I'm also hearing the name Walter. Walter. Let's clarify the level card here, Virgo. Clarifying the level card for you. And we have, you know what? You, you're kind of confused as to what it is. Should you stay or should you go? You're at a level to where you're, some of you all are very comfortable, but you got to let that go. See, let it go. It's time for a change. It's time for you to say, you know what? I'm throwing caution to the wind. I'm just going to move forward. I'm not going to think about it. I'm just going to do it because I have faith in spirit and I have faith in myself. Okay. Overall energy, Virgo, what it is that you, what is it that you need to be doing right now? You are maybe somewhat afraid, you know, uh, maybe a little shell shocked because of all the losses. You're feeling powerless and stuck and you just don't know what to do. The only thing that has been holding you back for such a long time, earthly Virgo, is you, you, you. See, this is a path. You don't know exactly where you're wanting to go, where this path or why this idea is taking you. Okay. Some of y'all want to move, uh, possibly relocate to a different city or state, maybe moving in with a, maybe moving in with a significant other or moving in with a roommate to save. But you're afraid because you don't know what's in this pathway for you. What's coming your way with this? What's coming Virgo's way with this path, this new journey? It's full speed ahead, success. <clears throat> I got to think. You think too much. Just do. Don't think, just do. Because we had, uh, where is it? Where is it? Okay. Don't think, just do. Just go for it. There's nothing else to think about. You, you, you've been at this long enough to know when it's time for you to move forward. Okay, no more thinking about it, no more you know, worrying about it, no more thinking that things aren't going to turn out the way you want them to. You just got to move forward. You're not going to fail. If you fall, if you fail, get your ass right back up. Virgo, what do you need to know? Bounds. Clarify the bounds card for Virgo. And we have no. You Right now, spirit knows no bounds and neither should you, Okay. You can go as far as you want to go and beyond because spirit has no bounds and neither do you. Like I just said, it's time for you to move forward. And you know what? Know what you need to do. I don't know. I keep hearing to tell you spirit has no bounds and neither do you. So there's some there's some things that that are do you. This is your season. This is your due season to go after what it is that you want. You got to no more. No more feeling sad and sorry. No more thinking that you're not going to have decent money in your bank account. No more living from paycheck to paycheck. Woo. I don't know, Virgo. I'm glad I'm a Virgo right now because we got the sun here. We got a new beginning. We got, you know, somebody getting pregnant here. We got opportunities for you. New opportunities, new stages of growth and potential in your life. What do you want? OK, you can have anything you want right now. Anything you think about, you can go anything you want. You can go for it. There are no bounds. There are no, nothing. Nothing is keeping you from starting over from scratch. OK, the only thing that's keeping you from starting over from scratch is you. And this is your message from Spirit. Spirit is telling you, you got this. You got this, boo. No more crying over what you lost. This is an opportunity for you to grow. This is an opportunity for you to be in that spotlight. No more um, boundaries that you're setting on yourself because you carry your load and everybody else's. Time, time up for all that. Okay. Let that load go. Drop that load, Virgo. Drop that load. And, you know, when you drop the load, people are going to get pissed because they because you're no longer going to be carrying them. You're no longer going to be holding their hand. You say, you know what? I've, I've led you to this point. Now it's time for me to let you go and live my life and do me. Got to. 
because when you when you do so much as you do for people it holds you back okay it keeps you from moving forward it bothers your self-esteem okay and that makes you feel like there's nothing that you can do story with this story you can build one you can write one tell your story to other people but this can also mean like a 10 story building or whatever you raise and raise and raise and you're not going to go lower anymore you want to go forward go up to the top okay raise raise your standards with who you are inside and people will follow suit there's nothing like i said that you can't do you are able to do this and then some okay you are able Okay, you are qualified, willing, and able, Virgo. What's this issue here with you, though? <clears throat> what is Virgo's issue right now, Spirit? The Knight of Pentacles. Uh, so maybe work. There may be... I think that you could be getting a raise. You're probably looking, you probably want to actually ask for a raise, Okay. Uh, and they may be a little hesitant to give you one. You're worried about your money, your income. I want a raise. I'm a Virgo. I want a motherfucking raise. I deserve it. Okay. So you may not get it. They may, they may have some sort of um, excuse as to why you're not getting it. Maybe they don't have the funds right now. Maybe they'll give you one, but it's mediocre at best. Okay. Got bath here. Uh, let's clarify bath. Some of y'all may need to take a spiritual bath to ground yourself. And we got around. Maybe some remodeling. Speak. You know what? You can also uh, meditate in your bathtub or shower. We have around. A spirit is around you more. Or you have people around you from the other side around you in the tub. And this is the best time for you to speak to people from the other side when you're in the tub. Okay. And also, you know, there may be some things you think about when you're in the tub or, or in the shower, the things that people have said to you, you hold on to, and it kind of bothers you what people say and what they do to you when you are at your most quiet place, whether you're in the bed, in the bath, in the shower or whatever, you contemplate on what people have said to you, you know, well, I should have said this, or I should not have said that. It's like you let things, what you say to others and vice versa, kind of like bother you, Virgo. You need to let go. What does Virgo need to know today? Conquer. Um, I think that, that there's more things going to come in your life that you can conquer. You've been able to conquer so much in your life, but you didn't realize it. Okay. You've never realized this, but now it's your turn to open these doors. Okay. I open these doors to opportunities that are coming your way, you know, higher, like I said earlier, like a 10 story building things for you are going to get so much more better. Um, life in general for you is going to be a year from now. We're all going to have a story to tell. We got death out with the old in with the new. You're not going to be worried or hurting anymore as much as you are. Yeah, we're going to have problems. That's just, you know, life. But it's not going to always be this way. I think it's time for you to realize that you deserve better. There's going to be some sort of offer coming your way, a new offer. It could be for a new job, a new position within the company that you're in. Um, this could be you offering somebody something of you that's brand new, a new relationship, a new home. You just have a new just outlook on life in general. And with you opening your eyes to see the clarity of the things that's coming your way, it's going to put you in a position, a higher position in life. OK, it really, really is. So I hope that this message res resonates with you all. Uh, don't forget, I am open for readings. Information to contact me for a reading is in the description section or the comment section. All right. Talk to you soon.